Ni fundi wa mbao wakipigiria misumari ya mwisho kwa shirika koba ofisi ya mwalimu mkuu wa shule ya Vurana Isiolo imefungwa As board of this school we have locked the principal's office and anybody tries to open it we shall face you with with wrath through together with the parents we don't want that principal there kindly if you want Isiolo boys to continue Minister of Education TSC and the community leave the board to manage until you interfered this school had peaceful tranquil environment but the big man of this school is the board we are representing the ministry the principal sector of education and even the TSC we are the managers if we are the managers on behalf of the ministry and the TSC and the parents and the school belongs to parents that gentleman let me start don't take him to another school or give me an office in his office because a very senior commissioner and very powerful we are not going to accept him so that is our message to the commission that's meant to the TSC Mohamed Boru abaye mwenyekiti wa bodi simamizi ya shule hii akielezea sababu yao kuchukua hatua hii the deliberation we discussed and we agreed as a team all of us the the then principal was supposed to hand over and report to the new station in Maua or in Meru and then we were supposed to accept a new deputy principal who was transferred from Nordistan who came here as a teacher but we recommended he become a deputy Mr. Wario we signed that letter and accepted him but the board categorically refused to accept the incoming principal Mr. Barako and after the, after the uh, deliberations it was agreed that he was not going to report and teacher service commission convinced us that they will take over the school and hold on it until a new principal comes and i left behind my deputy bishop kalunyu to sign the document on behalf of the board and the deputy director tsc also signed on behalf of the commission or tsc in that office when we left on thursday we knew the acting principal for the school was deputy uh, director of tsc and we agreed to consult further but the tsc behaved unethically and behaved wrong and forced the guy we refused to the school it's very sad because TSC as the employer of teachers in this country it was supposed to uphold ethics and integrity when stakeholders agree and finish on something for the goodness of the school they cannot bring in at night or in the evening or in the absence of the board sneak a, a teacher who was refused i'm just wondering at the chair of this school that principal if is going to be installed by force in this school is going to work with who the board does not want him the parents don't want him atafanya kazi na nani This is the same principal three years ago when I was not the board chairman the former board refused him because of non performance go to the director and ask him ask her who brought me here they requested me to come around this school and I don't fear you and you are not the one appointing this board the board is appointed by the ministry we shall leave when our term ends but as long as we are here as the board of this school we want to tell you we can't allow you to take this school back to the dogs Correct. this school came from very far We struggle together with our our responsible teachers. We don't want allow anybody to come and take us back. E Muhammad Boru na bodi yake wakikosoa pakubwa washikadao wanaoingilia utendakazi wa bodi yake. Deputy president came here. He raised 20 million for his solo boys. The confused team did not distinguish between a boys and a girls school. I want to see between Isiolo girls and Isiolo boys. The money is in Isiolo girls. Mr. Ali Dima, I know you are looking for a contract, especially for your cousin here. That's all you are fighting. There is no contract in Isiolo boys. The school has no money. Go to principal Isiolo girls, ask for a contract there. Let me assure you, I'm very proud to represent the governor. I am the deputy county secretary, and I know I am diligent in my job. You also know I perform. But the role I'm playing today was not given to me by the governor. It was given me by education board, county education board, and because of my credentials. I was served this ministry for 15 years. Najua kwamba tumesidikiwa, tumekewa lawama ati kwamba sisi tume overstay. Atuwezi kuwa tuwezi kuruhusiwa na county education board ku overstay kulingana na sheria kwa sababu wao wanazingatia professionalism na kuhakikisha kwamba mashule ya Isiolo yanaendelea kama vile inapaswa. Usingatii ukabila. So kusema sisi ni kabila is baseless, is unfounded kwa sababu sisi tunaangalia utendakazi ya mwalimu. Na tunataka kuona kwamba 
e, zule yetu inaendelezwa kama inavyopaswa vile vile wamesema ya kwamba e, tuko na interest yes tuko na interest for the best interest of the child of Isiolo tunataka academic development for personal development of every child in Isiolo county kwa hivyo tunaomba watu ambao hawana hawana habari wasikimbilie biombo ya habari na kupeana uongo wakisema kwamba tunafanya kwa county Jiti tutashirikiana na county tutashirikiana na serikali ya, ya national government kuhakikisha kwa mambo ya elimu katika county letu. Hatutakubali kuzua uoga, hatutakubali kusukumiwa kama eh, board ya ishule pamoja na wazazi, pamoja na wasikadao wenye nia nia nzuri kama county education board, kama PTA, kama wazazi wa ishule, kama wanachiaza wetu kama MCA wetu eh, wale tuko nao hapa leo tunataka kuhakikisha kwamba shule ya Isiolo mahali imebaki imekuwa imeinuka tutaendelea tutaendelea tutaruhusu mtu yeyote aturudishe nyuma